Wow. This is where we store all of our preserved what? fish. What is that I'm smelling? Well, that's probably the alcohol fumes. We have all our fish arranged uh, by family and then alphabetically by genus. This is Trichodon trichodon. If we look at the uh, tag here, he was caught in the Gulf of Alaska. There could be anything in here. There could be any. It could even be live. Here's a nice big rockfish. Oh. One of my favorites is the, uh, the spiny lump sucker. Do you have any idea why they call it a lump sucker? I don't know. Some therapeutic value. Yeah. You ever dropped one of these? A few times. This is a batfish. Oh my god, look at this thing. October 8th. 1885. This is the variety pack? This is the variety pack. <coughs> Common right found around here. Barracuda, maybe. A goose fish, because they eat goose. Come on. Seriously. They eat geese? They eat, they will consume an entire goose with that mouth. They will open it up. This is a small one. Here's an angler fish. The males are much smaller and they're parasitic. Uh, to the female? Oh yeah, in fact, here's one right now. This is the male. He's attached. He's fused to the female's body. What? And this is the male fish. This is the male fish. This thing right here, this little inch-long thing, is that's the male fish. That's right. How many jars of fish? How many total? Well, I think we've got about thirty-five thousand. It's just a, a thin sheath of skin. Chesapeake Bay, nineteen twenty-one. This one was caught in, caught in the Gulf of Oman in freshwater fish. What, wait a minute, what's this here? You found our most valued specimen. Well, these specimens are old. Yeah, I told you they're old. Yeah, but never do.